standing by, everyone, standing by. I'll 
I'll be up in just a minute. Don't you worry. I am on my way. You know it takes me a second here, so... Just sit back and relax. And enjoy our decor. Oh, hey everybody! It's me, Shelvis, your favorite clam Elvis impersonator. Happy fall! I'm just gonna scoop these out of the way a little bit. Uh, I know you might be sad about the end of the summer, but fall is great too. So uh, let's sing about it. Hit it. so much to say we just have the autumn equinox that's when daylight and night are the same amount of time and it's cooler so put on some song there's a chill in the air and a bright in the breeze With the trees changing color with gold and orange leaves Sweater weather is here I'm so happy, my dear Aren't you glad that it's autumn today? You know, fall is such a special time. There's apple picking and corn mazes, and you can do those things while you're social distancing. It's still a fun time, and it's exciting to start planning for Halloween. Even if you might not be going door to door this year. Instead, maybe you'll go on a hayride or have a virtual costume party. You'll still get to eat candy, right? Everybody loves candy. Fall is also a great time for raking the leaves in great big piles and jumping in and eating cider donuts and carving funny faces into pumpkins. Did you know you can toast the seeds from those pumpkins to make a tasty snack? It's for real, I promise. And of course, everything is pumpkin spice, but that's okay too if you don't get carried away. I guess what I'm trying to say is autumn is really cool, and I'm not just talking about the temperature. The scarecrow says, come on, even though summer's gone, we're so glad that it's autumn today. Thank you. Thank you very much. Fuzzingers, what do you say we go find some better candy than these candy corn? There must be some chocolate around here somewhere. See you, everybody. Show this, everyone! With the Fuzzingers on Backup Focus. And I'll be right there. Please hold. Yes. 
Yes, it does feel like summer today. But it sure didn't yesterday. Oh, my. Okay. Ah, I don't know what shell this thinks is wrong with candy corn. I think it's delicious. Yeah. Anyway, uh, so what are we reading this week? Now, I actually did not read a book about autumn. Nope. I read a book about Jim Henson. Yeah. Do you know him? Tomorrow is his birthday, and even though he's not around anymore, sad, he's really, really important to us here at Gnome Home. Yeah, I can say for sure that uh, I would not be here if it weren't for him. No. So uh, I read I Am Jim Henson by Brad Meltzer, illustrated by Christopher Eliopoulos. Hold on, I'll show you the cover. There it is. Oh no, my collar is falling off. Trish, can you, um... Oh yeah. Hi, Dolores. Hi, Trish. I like your collar very much, though. Thank you. It's a very nice tribute. Okay. Okay, thanks. You're welcome. Um, so, when Jim Henson was a kid, he liked drawing and jokes and uh, watching movies and playing pretend. Yeah. He and his friends liked to make props and costumes out of stuff they found around the house. Kind of like what we do here. Yeah. And he really, really liked watching TV. Especially puppet shows. Yeah. He knew he wanted to work in TV when he grew up. And you know what? With hard work and lots and lots of practice, he ended up inventing the Muppets. Yeah. You know, like um, Bert and Ernie and uh, Kermit the Frog and Fozzie Bear. Yeah, and he worked on Sesame Street and uh, The Muppet Show and lots of great movies too. Yeah, best of all, he believed in the goodness of people and the power of imagination. And we do too. So happy birthday, Mr. Henson. Yeah. That book was heavy. I had to put it down. Uh, and we want to say hi to um, Dory and Teresa and Sylvia and uh, anyone else who might be watching us today. Now, uh, it's time for uh, our usually questionable section of the show. It's Jokes with LB and Hans. So I'll go get them. Hans and LB! Hans and LB, you're up. Hope you got some decent jokes. See, Hans is always on time. I'm coming, Dolores. I'm coming. Huh. Hi, everyone. Hi. I'm LB here with my pal Hans. Yeah. Uh, uh, Hans, do you like autumn? Yeah. You may need to get a little sweater or something because uh, it's going to be chilly soon. And uh, we don't want you to be a chili dog. <laughs> uh, anyway, we have some great jokes for you today. Are you ready? Yeah? Okay.
Okay, here we go. What did one leaf say to the other leaf? Pub. It said, I'm falling for you. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, how do you fix a broken pumpkin? Not like this one. That's not broken. Give up with a pumpkin patch. <laughs> pumpkin patch. Okay, uh, next. What is the tree's least favorite month? Huh? It's September. Did it? Did it hard? Because that's what you say when you cut down a tree. Yeah, that's why that's funny. <laughs> okay, uh, why do birds fly south in the fall? Hogs? No, that is what birds do. No. Uh, birds fly south in the fall because it's too far to walk. Obviously. Yeah. Uh, what happened when the turkey got into a fight? Nothing. Yeah. He got the stuffing knocked out of him. <laughs> and finally, why did the scarecrow... Hi, scarecrow. Why did the scarecrow win the Nobel Prize? Hans? Because he was outstanding in his field. <laughs> hey, congrats on that, Scarecrow. Uh, nice job. We should go celebrate. Uh, if you could get down from there. Yeah. What's that? Maybe later? Uh, okay. Well, we'll save you a seat. Uh, let's go, Hans. Bye, everyone. some autumnal humor, yes, and uh, coming up next, we have Fox and a Squirrel, Fox and Squirrel, they'll be right up. In just a moment. Uh, hello, hello there, darlings, and happy autumn. I am here with my old friend, Squirrel. Squirrel, you might want to take it easy on those candies. You don't want a tummy ache now, do you? Or to spoil your appetite for lunch? Okay. Uh, we are here to demonstrate a fun and easy art project for fall. Yes. Would you like to see it? We're going to do something called leaf rubbing. Leaf rubbing. It sounds strange, darlings, but I have no doubt you'll be finding it most enjoyable. Right, Squirrel? All right, first, you need to find a nice leaf with lots of veiny bits. Yes, those are the lines on the leaf that hold all the parts together, you see. Now, uh, Squirrel, would you be a dear and uh, fetch a leaf for us? Marvelous. Okay, Squirrel will be right back with our leaf. Oh, how lovely! Yes, uh, this 
is a leaf, I believe, from a uh, hosta bush. Yes, you see, our, our trees haven't really uh, changed yet, but we did find this one, which is quite nice. Uh, so now, once you uh, have your leaf, you'll want to place it with the veiny side, I panned down, veiny side up. Now that's good, that's good, like so. Uh, and then uh, we will need a piece of paper. Uh, any scrap paper will do, or uh, copy paper, or uh, tissue paper, yes. Uh, squirrel, would you? Ah uh, yes, that's perfect. Yes, now uh, you place the paper on top of the leaf, just so, as we have. Uh, and next, we will need uh, some crayons. Uh, let's do one to start, Squirrel. Oh uh, yes, uh, that looks like uh, uh, orange, perhaps. Excellent fall color, and my color as well. Yes, uh, so uh, hand me that. Uh, and if you wouldn't mind uh, holding the paper for me. Now, uh, what you want to do is take your crayon and simply rub it uh, all over the paper where the leaf is. Okay, uh, you do it on the side of the point, uh, and let's see how it, how it goes here. How's it go? How does it look, Trish? Does it look nice? Um, may, may I help you? Oh, sure. Oh. Can I give it a try? Absolutely. Let's see. Okay, leaf, veiny bits. Okay. Oh. We had to call in the expert. Oh my goodness, look at this. I cannot wait to show our... Oh, that's marvelous! Look at that, isn't that fun? Oh my! May, may I show everybody? Oh please, yes, please do. Okay, I don't know, can, I don't mean to block you, Fox. It's beautiful! Look at that! Fantastic! Yeah. Yes. Now, uh, what you could do yes. is uh, place the uh, paper on a, a different spot over the leaf oh. to create an overlap. Okay, should I use uh, the same color? No, uh, Squirrel, please fetch another crayon. Okay. Let's see, what color? Oh, thank you very much. And this is cerulean. These are fancy colors. Yes. Okay, so let's try this. I'm so excited. I just cannot hide it. I know, I know, I know. I know you want color. You want color. Oh my. It's breathtaking. <laughs> oh yes. Oh. <laughs> it's a masterpiece. <laughs> Oh, I love it! Very nice. So fancy. Uh -huh. And you know I like to be fancy, darling. <laughs> you too. Yes. Oh. All right. Well, it is stunning. We should frame it. Would you like it? We'll put it on the fridge. Or the gnome home gallery. Okay, we'll put it on the fridge. Have we lost a crayon? I, no, I, I, don't, I don't know what that was. Well, who knows? <laughs> uh, anyway, so... My dears, now you know what to do to create your very own leaf rubbing. It's fun and exciting, and uh, your grown-ups at home will be so impressed. Yeah, it's yes. a fun thing to do at home. I can't stop. She'll be doing this all day, everyone. All day. Okay. I love it. Simply marvelous! <laughs> applause! Applause for Trish! <laughs>
All right. Uh, would you be a dear and uh, clear those surpri supplies away for us? I can do that. Okay, okay. thank you. Yeah, okay, can I have a candy corn? Certainly. Okay, thanks. Sorry, Scruff. All right. Uh, we'll send out Jilly Bean to say hello next. Uh, so, ta-ta, darlings. Happy autumn. Jelly gets ready. How is everybody doing? <laughs> I'm probably not supposed to eat on camera, but I am. Who's gonna stop me? You. You. No. Oh. I uh, had to rush down here. I had a, a work meeting before this, and uh, here I am, so I'm, I'm dressed up a little fancier than I normally would Hi, be. Hi, Trish! Hi, Jelly Bean! Hi, everyone! <laughs> I bet Dolores could stop you from eating on camera. <laughs> You're not the boss of me. No, oh, well. Anyway. Uh, so, yes. do you guys remember uh, last week it was our stagehand's birthday? Remember that? I do remember that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, and Cranston asked people to donate to Puppet Show Place Theater. And guess what? What? They did! Yay! Yay! <laughs> so, we especially want to thank uh, Lauren and the Quants, mm -hmm. and Wendy and the Amadons. Oh, yeah. Uh, and Sandy and Lester for their very generous donations. Indeed. Yeah. yeah. Your money is a big, big help. And we want to thank everyone who has donated to Puppet Show Place. So um, maybe we could sing a little song about that? We could try. Yeah? Yeah. You want to try? Okay, great. <clears throat> Thank you so much, thank you so much, you're the best, you're the best, you're so kind and thoughtful, and we love you so much, thanks again, thanks again. Yeah, all right. Maybe uh, we could do one more verse. Whatever you want, Jelly. It's the least we can do, right? Okay, ready? Okay. Your donations make us happy. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. Thanks for helping show place. We love puppet show place. Thanks again. Thanks again. show place, you can join the fun at www.puppetshowplace.org slash emergency dash fun. All right. uh, it might be a long time until we can all go to the theater again. Uh, so your money helps keep the theater going and uh, to do online and outdoor shows, uh, and to preserve this special home for puppetry in New England. Yeah, so thanks again. Uh, and Trish, you can stay right there, uh, okay. and I'll go get Dolores. Okay, it's nice to see okay. you. Bye, everyone! Jamie!
<laughs> Jelly bean, everyone! I hope Dolores doesn't yell at me when she comes out. We'll see. Although well, I did help her out earlier. I'll be right there! Okay. here chewing. <laughs> no more snacking on camera, please. We're trying to keep a professional show going here. All right? All right. Okay. okay. You can eat all the candy you want in a few minutes. Okay. I feel safe. Right. Okay. I needed some energy after it. You see that? That was part of the thing. It went pretty well. And it ended right before this. So it was good. Yeah, time. that was lucky. Wow. Yeah. We thought we'd have to start the camera all by ourselves. No, we don't have to. Nobody that. wants that. <laughs> no. But thank, uh, thank you for asking. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, so remember the other day when we went to the zoo? I sure do. That was so much fun. And we saw the pretty lights? We yeah. Gorgeous lights. Yeah. It was so cool. Did you guys uh, want to see that? You guys, if you haven't watched our video from yesterday, you should check it out. Uh, at Franklin Park Zoo, they're doing something called Boston Lights. Uh, and it goes until November 1st. Yeah. You can see big light up uh, animals and uh, flowers and stuff. Yeah. And um, now that it's darker earlier, you can even go before your bedtime. Yeah. Yep. Uh, should we talk about birthdays? Love to. Okay. All right. Uh, so last week, our good friend Harper turned two years old. Yeah. Sorry, we missed that, Harper, but we wish you happy birthday. Yeah. Uh, then Tuesday, uh, yesterday, was Mara. And Billy's birthday. Mm -hmm. Yep. Uh, and today uh, is no one, as far as we know. <laughs> Somebody's birthday. Uh, tomorrow, like uh, I talked about, is Jim Henson's birthday. Yep. Uh, Saturday is Alice and Kyle. And Sunday is Veronica. Cool. Shall we sing to them? I would love to sing <laughs> to them. Okay. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to Harper and Mara and Billy and Jim Henson and Alice and Kyle and Veronica. Somebody tells you that they don't like it, then you don't do it again, right? 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 It's okay, Trish. All right, I promise I won't do it again. I'm sorry. I was stern with you. That's that's okay. I I didn't mean to be mean. Well, no, no. We, we you know I love you. I love you too. We talked it out. It's all. Oh. I love her so much. <laughs> <laughs> um. So anyway, that's our show about uh, autumn and. RBG and Jim Henson and other stuff. <laughs> ah, so, as always, and more than ever, don't forget to listen to each other and stand up for each other and be kind to each other and wear your masks and wash your hands. Okay? Is my bun coming undone? A little bit. Oh, well. At least it's the end of the show. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, should we sing the closing song? 
I would love to sing the closing song. Okay. All right, are we ready? <laughs> Thank you.